good. I'm sorry I've been so distant. I... Uh... Come in! Exciting news. Claire might have a boyfriend. Oh, good for her. Yeah. Yeah, I hope it's better than that last guy. Do you hear these two? What on earth are they feeding these kids? <gasps> wow, what the heck? They're really going at each other. Oh my god. They could go at each other a little bit quieter. This is so stupid. It's not like we have neighbors Wait. or anything. What? Don't be that loud. Okay, they can hear us. Hi, friend. Yeah, sorry. Polly. Okay. I just ha I have an AM tomorrow and I Okay, I'm gonna say something. No. Don't, don't. Just just please. Just wait it out. Okay, okay. we okay. don't okay. like an okay. hour. Okay. Fine. Man, they are being really loud, though. Okay, sex doesn't sound like that. There, that, the bang. Is he the Tin Man? Oh my god. If that doesn't stop in an hour, I'm going over there. Okay, I can't sleep like this. Don't I'm gonna go, go over, over there. there. Don't go over that, there. Is that a don't. hammer? Are they building a dresser? No, no, don't go over there and make a fucking scene right now. No way, that's not sex. That's impressive. No, Come on, that is that so, impressive. that's so impressive. How do they get a hammer in there? How do you work a hammer into the whole thing? I mean, that's just like, I can't even think. I, I'm going over there, I'm taking the door down, and I'm breaking her goddamn face! Please don't do that right now. No. no. Who? Please don't do that. I don't remember what I said about the scene? Don't make a fucking scene or no? I'm making a scene. I have safety concerns. They're gonna think we're not cool. What the fuck are you talking about? Claire's over there having crazy ass fuck furniture building sex. And, and we haven't brought somebody back here in months. Years and you want to go over there and be all oh, it's 12 p.m. on a fucking Tuesday And I, and I got homework and class. Oh my god. They're gonna fucking make fun of us That's why you stopped me Yeah, I feel, I feel like I'm being I'll fucking kill you. Oh my god. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Shit I don't I don't know what kind of that just I think it was really tired. You're good. You're good, man. Alright, well look, they're quiet now. Yeah. Uh, we're just, you know, we're we're tired. We're stressed. We're both Hold on. What? What? They're the best to ever do it. Hello there. My name is Otis McGoughlin. I am the CEO of Oat Milk Inc. I'm here today with some exciting news. We are happy to announce the future release of the highly anticipated Oat Milk 5. We cannot wait for you to experience the latest and greatest in milk alternative innovation. 
Alt Milk 5 promises to deliver bold new flavors. Never before quaffed textures, versatile use, and much more. But before that, I would like to take you on a little trip. Oat Milk 1, commonly known as Oat Milk, was a beautiful beginning. It was fresh. It was simple. It was everything it needed to be. It started niche, but quickly grew, faster than HIV, Dungeons and Dragons, or air travel. It flourished for a time, but then we had to ask, what came next? On to Oak Milk 2, the sexiest thing in milk since breastfeeding. Oat Milk 2 was laced with the hottest fashion drugs, meant to help you break it down with this breakdown of the beverage. From there, the pivot into Oak Milk 3 was only natural. Everything you loved about oat milk. But now, you are able to drink it in the metaverse. <laughs> From there, it will. Oh, Jesus. You're showing that on television? What happened? Forget it. Oh. And now, after a long, long time, Oat Milk 5 is finally here. When we first started to develop the concept... Father. Oh, yeah. you're alive. I'm free, Father. Free at last. What the... We thought you died. What the hell happened to you? You happened to me. All those hours alone in the lab, perfecting Oat Milk 4, our family legacy, creating it drove me so mad, I didn't recognize my friends or family. I killed our cat and threw it at my therapist like a dodgeball. And then, it changed me. Removed the skin from my bones, the calcium from my bones, the bones from my bones. Now Oat Milk 4 is all that's left. I didn't do this to you. No one did! I knew it's what you wanted from me when you hired me, but instead of thanking me, you banished me! See the oat! See the milk! We hired you to work in the mill. You were fired for breaking into the laboratory! It matters not. I knew after the calamity caused the Oma 4, I had to keep it secret. No one could do this again but me, so I stored it all in me. Odie. Odie, no, don't do this. Odie! Odie! No! No! Are you ready to go? Yeah, I just need to use the bathroom real quick. Okay, sure. Just uh, don't fall in. I'll do my best. Oh, damn, that sucks. You ready to go? Yeah, let's go. Oh my god, Dan! It's been, what, like six months? Yeah, how have you been? I'm good. I'm sorry I've been so distant. I... Welcome, welcome. Uh, anyways, you were saying? My ex. Uh, he, he was super controlling. I mean, he wouldn't let me see my friends. Wait, is he like after you or something? No, oh my goodness. No, it, it's stupid. It's, I don't want my neighbors to think that I don't fuck. What the fuck are you talking no, about? No. I don't want them to think that I'm not cool. Or something. Claire, that's ridiculous. Why would they think that? Well, it's happened before. I've heard them talk about and make fun of people who don't fuck. It's totally brutal. I just can't help but wonder if I'm next. 
Oh my god, this sounds totally stupid. I also may have told them that we were dating. So, I'm so sorry. I just don't want them to think that, that I lied. Oh, no, of course not, Claire. Really, I understand. That's great. Wait, I have an idea. If you want to make sure they really believe us, to be convincing. <laughs> probably do it, right? Yeah, that should do it. So that's what it's supposed to sound it like. You're making a Come on! scene right now. You're making this. Oh my god. Colin! This is so fucking it's stupid. Fucking door. This is so fucking Just go, let's do it, do it. This is day five that I'm trapped on this uh, small fishing village off the coast of Scandinavia after my ship wrecked. Um, I'm out of food, water, everything basically. The only things I have left are this camera, um, the lovely family of coconuts that have taken me in as their own, and then this weird message in the sand. I have no idea what it means. We have to find out a way to raise our profits or we are going to have to lay off a lot of you guys. Surely there's something we can do here. Well, I'm all out of ideas. And don't call me Shirley. What? Oh! Oh, like, like from the movie Airplane. I get it. Get what? I've never seen that movie and I don't find it very funny. We've worked together, what, two years now at this company? You can't even be bothered to remember my name. Oh, no, 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 no. I... I was saying Shirley, not Shirley. Hey, uh, do you need me, boss? Uh, who are you? I'm Shirley. You called me in here. Do you do you not know who I am? Don't feel bad. I've worked for him for ten years, and he still doesn't know my name. <laughs> no, that's a, I wasn't saying Shirley. I was just <sighs> okay. So then, why did you call me in here? Okay, just a little misunderstanding. It's fine. Can we please move on now? Okay, you were the one who called me Shirley, but whatever. All right, listen, the shareholders are not happy with us right now. The shareholders, they've really got us by the gonads, guys, and we need to figure out a way to hold on to get. Hey, boss, should I just go ahead and close our location over on Marshall Street? Okay, surely there is something that we can do yeah, sure, to definitely. fix the situation. I mean, at this rate, I just think we need to sell the whole company. What? I don't see a way out of this. No, 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 it is not that serious. I mean, there's got to be a way we can salvage this without selling the whole company. One second, I have to take this. Yellow. What? Wait, 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 wait. No. What? What? Who closed the Marshall Street location? This is terrible. Company stock is going to plummet. They're going to lay all of us off. Well, maybe just you guys. But, sir, I had explicit permission and confirmation from you to close the Marshall Street store like 30 seconds ago. You closed the store? Who the fuck are you? Jesus Christ, boss, you got a real problem with names, you know that? We've heard to your wife, 
20 years? You don't even remember any of us. Sir, my name is Lee, and when I asked if we should close the branch, you said, sure, Lee. Oh my god. I said, surely, surely, not sure, Lee. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, no, that, that makes a lot more sense. Yep. I, that's, that's on me, I'm, oh yeah, I'm, god, sorry. I'm sorry. Yes. But like, do you know any of our names? That's a good I name. know you know. Are you sure? I, I have know. a hard time with names, and, and that's why yeah. I implemented the name tag. Idea. We should you have you have to wear name tags. We're adults. You, you, adults. You've known us oh for decades. I can't you're professional. I, I don't know. Do, do you know what college Shirley went to? He looks really familiar. Shirley Temple? But I don't know how that's important right now. We really need to focus. All right. So you want Shirley Temple for you? Does anyone else want drinks right now? Um, just a water for me. Water, dump, should we dump? What the fuck is going on? Who are you? Uh, I'm Steve. I'm your server for tonight. Can I get you guys in the apps? I don't care who the fuck you are. Why is everybody wearing suits? Well, it is my birthday. Not surprised you forgot. You can't even be bothered to dress up. I'm sorry, man. Happy birthday. Man? <sighs> Fifty. God damn years for this company. What's my name? Uh, Shirley? Okay, fuck you, man! Okay, it well, is fucking well, listen, Derek! Listen, my name I'm is sorry, Derek! I'm sorry. I've been oh, working for him for a oh, whole God. century! Good evening, I'm Nick News. An update on the chilling story out of Syracuse tonight, we have an interview with the horrified roommate of disgusting sex pervert Colin Mosley, who was arrested earlier today after being way too into his neighbor's sex life. Let's take a look. Hey, wise guy, where do I put this thing? God damn, what a bright young woman. Well, it just goes to show you folks, you can't trust your neighbors, you can't trust your coworkers, heck, you can't even trust your own flesh and blood. You stay safe, America.